Welcome to Palmer Update TV, a free plastics raw material news show. You are watching weekly trends in Palmer buying and selling with me, Tejal Hode. It is Wednesday, June 5th. This week, PVC prices gained in the Asian region. OPEC plus Alliance plans to wind down voluntary output cuts totaling 2.2 million barrels per day from October 2024 till September 2025, which could lead to excess oil supplies flooding the market, pressuring prices lower. Meanwhile, suppliers have pointed out that even though petrochemical derivative prices have been experiencing significant hikes in recent times owing to spikes in freight rates, the sustained decline in crude oil prices over the last few trading sessions has narrowed the delta and boosted confidence among market players. Furthermore, market participants are closely monitoring the current market development. In China, PVC prices were assessed at 800 to 810 US dollars per metric ton CFR levels, a week-on-week -week increase of $10 per metric ton. Domestic market conditions in China witnessed a steady improvement on the back of stimulus measures rolled out by the government. However, replenishment activity was largely constrained with most buyers opting to remain on the sidelines owing to volatile freight trades. The bearish sentiment was shared by a few other market players who did not believe that bullish sentiment would persevere given the country's PMI data for May had shrunk. While export trade talks had slowed down on the back of rising freight rates, there was a minimal transaction activity in the region with market players pointing to a narrow arbitrage window. Nevertheless, rising prices in the domestic Chinese market prompted sellers to raise their offers. In Southeast Asia, PVC prices were assessed at 810 to 830 US dollars per metric ton CFR levels, a rise of $20 per metric ton from the previous week. Prices climbed owing to spikes in the ocean freight costs across the Asia Pacific region. Meanwhile, demand from converters witnessed a declining trend throughout the week, chiefly owing to a sluggish construction sector disincentivizing the purchase of extra PVC material at higher prices. Demand had also weakened with most of the converters believing that their supply needs had sufficiently been taken care of by domestic PVC producers. Lower demand across the continent also helped to cap the rise in PVC prices to a certain extent. In India, PVC prices were assessed at 900 to 930 US dollars per metric ton CFR levels, a sharp week-on-week -week increase of $40 per metric ton. In India, prices gained amid the surfacing of offers in an intermittent manner which did not draw the requisite response from buyers. The paucity of container shipping space raising the prospects of delayed import cargo arrivals continued to keep Indian customers on tenterhooks. Overall, demand sentiment was noted as steady with the most regular suppliers scheduled to announce their July allocation offers over the next few days. Domestic suppliers experienced a significant pickup in demand for material, with import offers witnessing a gradual increase over the last two weeks. Domestic market players are seeking to procure Asian origin PVC material ahead of the mandatory BIS certification deadline for PVC imports in late August. Thank you for watching.